everybody, it's Dara. Hi everybody, it's Charles. I'm here with Charles. Charles came to visit me. Yay. And when Charles comes to visit me, how can you not turn the camera on this face? It's so much fun. I mean, I'm Seriously. so excited to be back and Yay. to say hi to everybody too. Yeah, everybody loves you. So when I have Charles on, what I told Charles is that I want him to just, I know he's up to some really good stuff. And what occurred to me, I thought about you yesterday actually. I was really? thinking, mm -hmm, I was thinking, I want Charles to tell his story, if, if you can describe how to follow your heart, because that's how we ended our last video. And you talked a little bit about your story about how mm -hmm. you were overweight mm -hmm. when you were younger and yeah. not feeling well. And just, he had an aha moment to start eating healthy mm -hmm. and look at you now. So I just share what we're up to. I'm about to make a little bit of chocolate so for us to have a treat. Yeah. So go ahead. I had that aha moment, and I think everybody has that, like, I'm settling for less, I know there's something greater. You're settling for less, you know, so some somewhere, I picture you, and I don't know if you said this, for those of you who didn't see the last video that Charles and I did together, how old were you when you realized that you this was not going to be the way to go? I was about, about 14, 15. That's amazing, and how old are you now? I'm 24. Okay, so 10 years ago, sitting in front of the TV, mm -hmm. kind of chub, I saw the pictures, he had a big chubby face. Big, like, yeah. I would not have guessed that. That, that wasn't was even my biggest. I'll probably post a picture so yeah. everybody can see. But. And you were beautiful and adorable, but like <laughs> the difference is like, I mean, this is like movie star right now. Oh, so, so Something deeper was going on with, within me because I was using food to numb myself. Mm -hmm. Because it was like I had anxiety and the only way to fill this void, everybody has it, whether it's um, mm -hmm. something that's going on deep inside, right? I felt that. I was like, I wanted to eat. I wanted to, to, to yeah. numb this feeling. And yeah. people use different remedies, but I use food and I knew that I always felt like crap. And I think I hit to a point where it's like, I can eat all the food in the world. It doesn't mm. solve my problem. Right. There's something deeper. Right. It's almost like when people get all the money they thought would make them happy and they realize they still have that gnawing angst that I'm not inside doing. of them. Yeah. That isn't, it's not the money. Mm -hmm. It's not going to be the food. Mm -hmm. Okay. That's really. So I put down the food because I would eat to a point where I was so uncomfortable. So we were just talking about your thoughts create your reality. Yeah, because really there are people sitting at home going, okay, how, Charles, how did you do it? Like, how did you, how do you, what do you tell yourself in order to get where you're at? I stopped watching the TV. There you go. Because the TV was feeding me so much fear and that was where all the anxiety was coming from, you know, um, comparing mm -hmm. myself to people who are put on pedestals, right? To think like, oh, how can I be there? You know, how can I get myself there? Comparing yourself, right. constantly putting yourself down, the negative thoughts. Okay. I started putting um, started listening to cassettes started mm -hmm. to pick up the books that are actually filling my mind with powerful thoughts ah. like unlimited possibilities things that can actually mm -hmm. change the way you live because when you think a different possibility then you start acting different and your habits change instantly yourself with positivity instead mm -hmm. of the box which is negativity and fear and mm -hmm. meant to keep us small mm -hmm. it's sort of like you're expanding I used to do that you're reminding me I used to listen to Marianne Williamson mm -hmm. Wayne Dyer mm -hmm. uh, Thomas Moore more Tony Robbins, as a, mm -hmm. Tony Robbins. Mm -hmm. There's no shortage of motivational people that will register with you, that will resonate with you. And even Dara's videos. And my videos. Yeah, like uplifting things. Fill yourself with uplifting. Look at your surrounding. Is your surrounding, mm -hmm. you know, serving your highest good? Are people around you keep feeding you fear? Put yourself in a sacred place so you can grow and you can dream big and you can think unlimited mm. thoughts like, wow, I'm powerful. Everybody needs to reclaim their power. Yes. Because we're unconditional love, so reclaiming our power, not giving it away. You know, like, like when people mm -hmm. go to the doctors right away when they're sick, you should understand yes. your body more yes. better than a doctor because they're sitting in there, you know, studying medicine. <laughs> You've been living with your body, your temple yes. for a while. You're putting, you're responsible for what you put into your diet. So you should know, wow, I'm feeling like this because I have a rash because I ate this. Right? Yeah. Or I've got a headache because I'm not dealing with this certain thing that I'm not dealing with. And mm -hmm. it's sitting there in the back of my mm -hmm. head. It's nagging at you, mm -hmm. yeah. Mm -hmm. It's a very powerful concept mm -hmm. that we are, we can empower ourselves. Empower, yeah. Take back your power because each and every one of you guys are so powerful. You guys are here with a special gift. You guys have something that 
that we can't do. That we don't have. Dara has gifts that I don't have, and I have a gift that someone else doesn't that have. That I don't have. <laughs> yeah, so it's like we Charles work together. Is amazing. <laughs> Charles is so good at connecting beautiful people. You see, Charles sees the beauty in somebody. He only sees beauty, for, and you will find what you look for. So try to see only the beauty in someone mm -hmm. and the beauty in life, because you will find what you're looking for. Whatever goal I have, I was always raised on this idea of universal responsibility, right? Thinking about not just yourself or your family, but how can I effectively help others and serve or mm -hmm. be of service, create something that's going to uplift someone else's life. Right. If we're only doing things like, oh, it's for my self gain and I'm going to get to the top of the mountain, are you going to be happy? And you're gonna be alone at the top of the mountain, and that's you'll have a lot of money. Way. Yeah, a lot that's, of people. Mm -hmm. That's the old paradigm before you were born. <laughs> yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah. We were taught yeah. just get to the top, step on heads. Mm -hmm. It doesn't matter if you're a woman and you want to get ahead, act like a man. Uh -huh. And it's not like no that emotions. anymore. It's, yeah. mm -hmm. it's, it's it's divine feminine. It's the masculine. Mm -hmm. It's emotions. It's spirit. It's the things we can't see mm -hmm. um, that are magic. That the only thing limiting us is our own limits, our own our thoughts. Own thoughts. On... Can you can you tell me what's on the table here? Oh my gosh. So last time I was here, mm -hmm. I told Dara off camera, I was like, Dara, I just had this vision. I want to create something that will uplift other people and open their hearts, right? Mm -hmm. And I think food is such a great gateway of bringing more love to people's life and being more conscious about what people yes. are putting into their bodies. Yes. So I created Lots of love treats that I brought for you. They're gorgeous. They're yeah. heart shaped. They're heart shaped and they're called lots of love because I just feel like love heals all. Everything. And these are healthy rice krispie treats. That's the treats. point of everything. Yeah. Healthy rice krispie treats made with quinoa. And there's... Oh my gosh. Yeah. Are coconut. You me? Uh, there's coconut <laughs> nectar mm. and there's cacao nibs, goji berries. Mm. And goji berries are good for cleansing your blood, vitamin A, mm. cacao nibs. And there's a little bit of organic peanut butter and mm. vanilla bean. If you're going to the movies and oh you're thinking gosh. of buying any of the whatevers, this is something, these are the wonderful things to keep in your purse, yes. in your car. These are treats. These are treats that mm. you can you can, you can give That's to yourself so and give to others. Congratulations. Thank you. Thank Seriously, you. congratulations because it's gorgeous. You. Yes. Yeah, these oh are gosh. so cute. And I'm thinking about putting a message behind each bar. So every time you take it off, there's a little message like behind really? it. And I'll say like, I you love are love that. or how do you love and just get people's conversation going about love because love heals everything they're gluten-free non-gmo all organic everything is just really clean mm. i'm coming out with new flavors too spirulina hemp and also a peppermint coconut mm. oh, i'm gonna bring you some next that's time that's beautiful yeah 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 so he manifested you manifested um, we sat here saying, you know, what what can you what do? do? What, yeah. what do you want to do? With some other things he's going to do. We have to stay, stay <laughs> Those tuned are in to the Charles. Works, yes. so. If you can practice unconditional love, then the whole, your whole day is set. Um, and I'm going to give you a little how I do mm -hmm. that. Get on a negative train of thought. We're mm -hmm. human. It happens. Definitely. What I say to myself and what I remind myself is I am love. I do that too. <laughs> I, I am love. love. I am love. And I am love. I choose. Mm -hmm. I choose love, not fear. I choose love, and I just. I am open. Yes, me too. And I even do this thing where I picture my face open, like instead of being contracted, I picture almost like like Lightness. this. Like you open your face so that mm -hmm. you're open to experiences. That doesn't mean you're open to negative energy. That means you're still protected. Yeah, you're opening to the possibilities. Mm. So it will change your day. It's a practice. It's no different from eating raw food or meditating or exercising. Being love is something to remind ourselves of. Mm -hmm, totally. Every mm -hmm. single day. Um, can you list your website and your channels? Because he's making beautiful videos yeah, and yeah, connecting yeah. with other people. So the website is rawyouth.org. <laughs> you guys could check it out for lots of great videos with Dara, just recipes, empowerment. Thanks so much for watching, guys. Yes, thank lots you. Of love. Get your greens on. Yes. Thank you, Charles, for yes. being here. Thank you. Yay. Awesome. It's a party. <laughs> Probably I'm eating it. Okay. Okay, It's okay. okay. That's part of the charm. Go. Okay, so take the mango slice, dip it in, and can you see that? I'm gonna put it 